Meet people. We get out. Yeah. The non-procrastinators. We're out there shopping, Leslie. <laughs> We do that grocery shopping. We need the items, but some might be met with minimal choices now and even price gouging. Oh, yeah, the shelves were kind of bare this weekend. Yeah. Six News reporter Bailey Bates did some online shopping for us to figure out just how much you'll be forking over this Thanksgiving. And she joins us now in studio. Hey, Bailey. Hey, Leslie, Chris. The hot topic right now is inflation and supply chain issues, and that's what many are concerned about when it comes to their annual Thanksgiving feast. Last year, the American Farm Bureau Federation said the average price of Thanksgiving dinner declined 4% from 2019. What the agency classified as a classic Thanksgiving meal in 2020 cost $46.90, or about $5 per person. Farm Bureau's data is based off the average across the country, where cities and states prices really vary. So I decided to see what Central Texans will be dealing with this year. Last year, the average price of a 16 pound turkey was just over $19. On Walmart.com, I found one you can buy for $15.68. Central Texans tell me that they aren't worried about the price, just being able to find the items they need. Shop early if you can. Um, and if it's something that could expire, look at the expiration date to see if it's something that you can have or freeze it, you know, until, until you need it. Um, and just shop around. I talked to some Central Texans today who were already knocking out their Thanksgiving meal shopping as well as their Christmas meal. Tonight on 6 News at 6, I have more price breakdowns for you, including your trimmings and pumpkin pie, and we'll discuss how my shopping compares to last year's meal averages. Guys. All right, Dave, Bailey's going to dive in. We're going to mm -hmm. find out your own personal experience. Thank you, Bailey.